Uh, so welcome back guys. My name is Amnon and in today's Make Launch Free campaign we have the Galaxy M30s device with us. And in today's tutorial we'll go about looking at how we can insert SIM card and SD card onto this device. So without further ado, let's begin. So let's jump in. So this is basically a setup that we have. We have the two SIM cards here, the external memory card here. We have the SIM card ejector pin out here. And this is basically the covering package for the SD card that we bought. So well, this is the Galaxy M30s device. Uh, I'll just prove it to you. Like we go to the about phone by going to settings. So this is the M31s like we said. And then again, like if we go to the SIM card manager, you will see that we don't have any SIMs as of now in the device. So we do obviously need to put in the SIM in the SIM tray. Now, like any other phone of Samsung, if I can just please focus on the left corner top side, you will see like we have this little small point wherein we put the SIM pin and there you go. This thing comes out. This thing is a little unique because if you see like this is the slot for the micro SD card. So like on the behind of it, you have basically the slots for SIM 1 and SIM 2. If I can just uh, zoom in, focus here. Yeah. So that is how it has to be. So another thing that you need to know here is like in other things you would be putting in basically front facing here it's actually facing backwards so this thing here actually goes backwards like this so that's how it fixes itself but it's a tight fix nonetheless so that is how you would fix the sd card and the same thing for the sim 2 and the sim 1 so wherever you want to put in the sim so for me say the idea i want to put it in sim 1 so it will not be facing frontward it will be facing backwards and then this little small curve it lets you know how it should go so it should go like this so there you go again it's a tight fix because when it fix fixes it gives a sound likewise this is the geo sim that i want in the sim 2 slot so again facing backwards and this little curve this little curve here and there you go again a tight fix once this thing has been fixed what you can do is you can just put it back in the device and there you go I have put it now we will wait for the network to get detected once the net network gets detected what you will see is like it should appear in like you know the sim manager so if I can now show you the sim card manager you will see that uh, we have both the sims detected idea for the sim 1 and then sim 2 for geo they are showing in hidden mode because we have the aeroplane mode turned on. We'll just turn that off and again wait for the uh, sims to appear. And you can see that the network has also come. Although I will prefer that you can once just do this by going to mobile networks and then assigning the proper network. Now for us, the sim 2 is basically Geo. We'll assign it uh, like LTE because it runs on LTE and sim 1 being idea, it runs on all the networks. So it's perfectly fine. So once you do that, you will see that the network for both things will fall in place you will get vault you will get lte everything should be perfectly fine well so far so good but since we also put in like you know sd card let's kind of look at whether that is working as well so that is under storage and storage is under device care so under device care i will go to storage and i will check and you will see that we have the sd card detected so like here you go so since we put in a 128 gigabyte so you are seeing this much space so hopefully this helps now you understand how you can mount a sd card as well as SD, uh, like sim onto the galaxy m31s device and also assign mobile networks if you think that was helpful kindly consider subscribing click on the bell icon for notifications also do share this with your friends and family so that people who have this device know how to like you know do the basic things like put in the sim assign mobile networks put in an external memory card and stuff like that Thank you so much.